Hello to everyone. This is Gunther Steiner. This is Speed City. You're listening to Speed City F1 on Sirius XM. The Speed City F1 post-race show on Sirius XM is brought to you by CrowdStrike. Stop today's most sophisticated cyber attacks at the office, the racetrack, and everywhere in between. Learn more at CrowdStrike.com slash XM. Don't forget the XM. Uh, Gunther brought us back, but Chris Medlin just caught up with Gunther Steiner. Let's hear that. Gunther, that looked like a tough day at the office. How do you sum that one up? Yeah, tough day. As you, as you just said, it was a tough day. Uh, I mean, we know that uh, on this uh, specific tracks, high speed, you know, where you need a low drag configuration, it's not, uh, our car is not uh, uh, good at this one. So we, we braced ourselves a little bit, but it's always disappointing when you end up like this. So we now look forward to Zandvoort, where hopefully we should be better. Yeah, I was going to say, I mean, you got a power unit penalty out of the way at least, and both cars have the upgrade. So next weekend, one with a lot more optimism? Yeah, I mean, uh, it, can, it cannot get worse than this, no, but uh, Zandvoort, you know, uh, if I look what we did in Austria and in Silverstone, you know, Zandvoort as well has got uh, medium and high speed corners where our car should be okay. Yeah, and uh, just as we look at things off track, silly season's in full flow. You've got at least one seat still available. I mean, where are you? With that? What's, uh, what's the latest? How involved are you in the whole silly season picture? Uh, we haven't made a decision. I mean, this is work to be done. Uh, we will decide in the next weeks, months, and we are in no hurry to, to, uh, to make any decisions yet. And how long is your list of drivers that could end up driving your car? Because Otmar Zafnauer said he's got 14 on his. Wow. Uh, I, I mean, I cannot, I cannot beat him on that one. You know, I don't know who he puts on there. Okay, well, good. Then we'll see you next week. Thank you very much. <laughs> Dave O'Neill, when uh, Gunther's voice hit, you just couldn't help but smile. I know he's actual. he's a good friend, isn't he, of yours? Yeah, yeah, he's a um, good friend, good work colleague, I guess. Um, but yeah, he's uh, he's interesting every minute of the day. Yeah, so. I'll bet. <laughs> you, you, Did you, know? you hear the nose twitch? <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, there was there was suddenly no nose twitch with the 14 drivers. So I think you were being honest that he has way, fewer than 14 on his list. You're on to it, Dave. You're right. <laughs> the way I interpret what he's doing is he's fishing. He's basically realizes that it's a robust market. Uh, he's got a good driver in Schumacher. There's nothing wrong. I don't. Yeah. I you, you're not a fan. I, I I was listening to Julian Palmer. He says he's done nothing wrong since Baku, and he's been on a level with Magnussen. Um, and so I would say that going into the next season, Haas aren't going to be you know thwarted by anything. But um, I don't know. He's 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 definitely fishing, isn't he? He's fishing. He's keeping his options open. He's saying exactly the same thing every yeah. time, and he always. He always is typically the last to do the, the signings. You yeah. Know, it's always October time. Yeah. You know? Do you think that's a strategy? I, I don't know if it's a strategy. It's, it's just more, a scrap. It can't have been with Magnus. Are you already yeah. busy on him? Sorry, well, yeah. when he got the call. Yeah. Um, I mean, unless you have bundles of cash, you can't be at the front of the queue. No. So right. I think, you know, waiting for the best one to drop is, is probably the, the scenario. Be in charge of the music if it's music of chairs. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay, boys, uh, I'll show this to the crowd on YouTube if they so, can see the camera. I wrote down ticket tickets. Let's give away. We have some tickets. We're going to start giving away some tickets probably Eric, every show in. between now and Coda. We have some tickets to Coda. Tickets Coda's. to what? To, to, well, <laughs> yeah. Give me, give me a second, Mr. Varsha. A circus. I'm going to give away a pair of tickets to the Formula One United States Grand Prix right here at Circuit of the Americas, and you cannot buy these. Because every time they put a ticket for sale, it sells out. They sold like out the Willy new Willy Wonka. Six, yeah. They, they had the new 6,000-seat infield grandstand that they had.